screen time, etc., <laughs> etc. Et so finally, it's going to be good to see uh, Germany really try to step up to the plate here. So I believe since it's Nico and Abadongo, I don't think I saw Raito go out to play. So I think this is going to be losers' quarters. So let's see how this goes down here. All right, so game one, PS2. I lied. It's loser semis. So oh, I guess uh, while they, they were gone. Okay, Nico pulling off a uh, upset against probably Raito, I believe, since Abadongo's the one that been, made yeah. it the other side. Yeah. Okay, well, Nico, man, our lone survivor here. Uh, Team USA trying to do something here against Team Japan, who's just dominating the bracket. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, just, uh, using those Monado arts as we all know to be able to change up his play style. There we go with the speed art. He's able to run in, get those fares, get that uh, increased air speed as well. <laughs> and I'm a, if I'm not mistaken, I believe this is probably the first time that Abadongo and Nico have played at least in Ultimate. Mm -hmm. um, but this is nothing that Nico isn't accustomed to. He definitely has some matchup practice against TL TLTC and um, Jump Steady, mm -hmm. who are like two of our most prominent SoCal Palutena's. Oh, I like the Ooh. idea. Oh, yeah. wow. Okay, that yeah. actually caused an untakeable situation. Yeah, and really like risky for Nico to do that because he dropped off of the ledge and unfortunately re-grabbing the ledge you don't have those invincibility frames and that was an easy punish for Abaddon with the up smash. Yeah. I like the idea he tried to use a nair the longest lasting yeah. hitbox he could think of to be able to cover the ledge but it just didn't quite work out there. Try something new probably not going to pull it out again but we'll have to see. Alright well he does have smash art active he gets a grab right here maybe able to get the KO but switches to buster instead yeah, it's going to attack on a little bit of extra damage. Oh, yeah, air slash. Just be able to wait and just cover that cross up as well. Yeah, no smash art available quite yet. But there we go. Yeah, not quite able to find anything. Able to find the timing right after Explosive Flame to burst in with a dash attack. But he's just having a hard time sealing off the kill right now. It looks like Abadongo is looking close to taking out his next kill right here. Okay, man. He's got a ton of damage already. Finally, Nico going to use that up special out of shield the air slash, securing him that stock, but he's got 109% to make up for. Mm -hmm. He's got a bit of momentum. He got that grab. Oh, okay. All right, jump art. Should be good right here. Checking his Monado Arts doesn't have the one that he quite wants. All of his movement ones are gone. So he's just going to take a little bit of time. Yeah, this is where he's going to kind of have to sit back a little bit more. Try to space out at the uh, very tip of his forward air. Try to cross up shield with the back air. Oh, that was weird. It looks like the back air hitbox didn't come out and Paulatana went just right through it. Now we finally got the speed art back online. Will we get some Nair trains? There we go. Got some Nair into the forward air. And jump art's available as well. Oh, but that's potentially a stock. Yeah, these guys in, but a quick switch to shield. Very smart. And we know Nico's yeah. very good at that. And shield art actually saved him from that down tilt that will, mm -hmm. as well. That down tilt would have killed if he had not been in shield Monado. Wow, neutral are actually doing it, though. Yeah. Very high percentage there. Abadongo looking really strong here. Two stocks, 77%. Nico down to his last life. He's got Buster Art active, trying to add a, a, a little bit of extra damage so that he can even this out as fast as he can. He's got yep. Smash Art now. Oh, fourth, fourth throw. throw. Not quite enough yet. Nice, okay. Great back air right there on Abadongo's ledge get up. Uh, and actually dead even percent. Nico not taking any percent to bring it right back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got ourselves an even game here. But here we go. Goes for the throw. And yeah, and just respects the shield art and just forces him to try and use it up. And there we go. And we got the cutscene coming in. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 49% cutscene, man. Can't complain about that if you're Palutena. Mm -hmm. Oh, he oh, still got hit by it. And he, he like flew into it. He almost converted off of that trade too. That's yeah, crazy. Yeah, back throw. Yep, put him off stage. That was so much damage off of that. That up smash, it's a very deceptive hitbox. It looks like it won't hit below the stage, but that time around, it just did. There's a back throw from Nico switching to Buster again. Oof. All right, just last second jump away from that explosive flame. That mm -hmm. definitely would have been the KO. All right. 
I like that he uses the tilt explosive flame to try and cover the space in front of him, try to delay the time that he can use with the arts. The back air covers that roll. Ooh, yeah, dash attack. Not enough. Actually, great DI towards the corner from Nico. Mm -hmm. Living a little bit longer. Yep, shield art is going to be gone very soon, though. Won't be able to use it for a bit. This is Nico. Ooh, excuse me. Abadongo's opportunity to really just get it back here and close out the stocks. There it is. There's yeah. the Nair. Ledge traps for days and go ahead and take that first game. Such a hard tool to deal against when Palatina is using neutral air by the ledge. I mean, it just stays out for so long, uh, has multi hits, and it KOs. So mm -hmm. it's a really just, you know, he, she can go off stage and throw out a neutral air, edge guard you. It's a, it's, a, it's a tough life for your opponent, mm -hmm. for sure. Yeah. To be honest, I, I didn't even know Abadongo played Palutena until today. Until I sat down. Every, every, <laughs> in, every inkling main <laughs> has a Palutena. What you're talking about? <laughs> you know, Abadongo has one, Chag has one, etc., etc. That's true. Yeah, but anyways. It's like good characters. <laughs> All right, looks like Nico just kind of taking his time, trying to see if he can approach the matchup a little bit differently, but going to get opened up immediately. Now the Nair trains come in, even with shield art, it's still going to be a problem. Okay, interesting. The wind box actually pushed him away, so Abadongo could have landed it, or he could have been safe either way, it looks like. Okay, Nico really uh, trying his best right here, applying a lot of pressure. Um, something I've seen is that he's he's really like trying to box Abadongo a lot of the time. Haven't really seen like too much spacing, but that also might just be like the fact that Abadongo is countering that spacing by staying away mm -hmm. the distance that he needs to. Like, yeah. All right, Ooh. there comes in. Great patience from Abadongo here at the ledge. Just kind of waiting there. Letting uh, Nico expend his Buster Monado art. Yeah, but now Smash Art is available. Tries to go for the air slash, try to cover something there. Not quite able to find it. Now he has the extra speed, but back throw, gonna put it back off stage. Oh, very nice stuff that time. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I think he air dodged. Yeah, I think he might have looked like yeah. he did something like that. I think he was trying to air dodge back at the stage and he like didn't clip it for some reason, yeah. so that was weird. All right. But, uh, okay, uh, Smash 4 is. Smash 4 uh, uh, game, yeah, it, yeah, Smash 4 terms right here. And it's almost, like, almost, dude. Like, literally six minutes and a half. Yeah, almost. Right, here we go. Oh, they're trying to get the re-grab, but I think that grab her box went away before the tech invincibility ran out. Okay, really unsafe Nair from Nico right there. Gets punished. Finds a little bit of damage there with the up special. Mm-hmm. Alright, that's another Nair. Yeah, both of these two are pretty much dead even right now. It's gonna have to be a matter who keeps up the ledge control. The Buster Art is available, but yes, the teleport cancel. Nico even tried to cover it, but I guess he just wasn't expecting it to be that fast, so his just timing on the buttons is not quite there yet. Yeah, really, Abadongo is just doing such a good job of imposing his hitboxes against Nico's hitboxes. They're a little bit quicker, too. I mean, Palutena's aerials are just so Whoa. fast. Oh, man, he... I guess he was waiting for him to, like, use... Oh, I don't know what he was doing. I think it was pummeling to try and get the back throw afterwards to guarantee a kill, but then Nigo with really great mashing, so he's able to get out of that. That was a big opportunity, too, because he got that parry on the down tilt, but forward tilt from cross stage, Yo. too? Okay, all right. Abadongo moving up yet another stock here. The back air into the dash attack. Really great 27%. Is he going to die here? Nope. Air dodging in the blast zone. Just to, Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Can't just start up of the uh, teleportation. Very vulnerable right there. Oh. All right. Nico with the chance right here. Not behind by much. Forward air dash attack. All right. Catching that up tilt. Trying to get another one on the platform. Abadongo searching for something here by the ledge. Retreating back to center stage as well. There's a grab. Oh, double jumps back on. Oh my god. Yeah, right. Nico looking like he's got another opportunity here. He's got to get a little bit more damage. Up till. Oh, he went for it, man. He just did not have the drift he needed. 
Had he like moved back a, just a smidge, you might have been able to secure that mm -hmm. up there. Yeah. All right, there we go. Get that neutral air. Another potential air guard situation. I'm looking for an up smash, maybe, or just a back air. No one gets anything there. Okay, grab him out of that unsafe landing from Abadongo. Okay, Nico with control of the ledge. This is really scary right here. Spacing the back air and catching the forward tilt, putting himself on the board. Even set count, one to one. Uh, mm -hmm. This is what I want to see. Yeah. Alrighty, one one for both of these two. Keeping things close right now. Absolutely. Alrighty. I, I don't know, man. Even if, even when Nico gets the the win on the on the game, he's he never looks satisfied. <laughs> nah, dude. He's too focused. It's like, I'm not satisfied unless I JV for right, someone, yeah. right? He's yeah. only having fun if he's, like, completely destroying his opponent. Yeah. All right, let's see how this goes down. Yeah, playing neutral, you know, just adding in a little bit of walking just to mix up the timing on how they're spacing each other out. Okay, neutral air to double forward air, triple forward air. That's 62% already on the board for Abba. Yo, is that Sheik? Yo, for <laughs> real though. On Smashville too. Yeah. Didn't even need the platforms. There we go. Gets that back throw. And that time, yeah, you recognize jump art and it's like, okay, you're probably going to jump back to stage. You're going to throw out an aerial. So let me just shield that. And let me back you throw off. And now you got no resources. Oh, and I'm going to counter dang. you. And now he's probably dead. Oh, unless no. the air slash clips him. Okay, never mind. All right. Okay, Buster Art getting the Nair into... Ooh! Yo! Alright, this is a really fast-paced match right here. A lot of uh, tilts being thrown out from both players. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. oh, 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 careful, man. Yeah, he thought he was going to land back on the stage, and I think he drifted a little bit too far back, yeah. Nico. Tomahawk throws him off. Okay, I like that back air, just recovering back to the ledge. Oh, <laughs> the grabs canceling each other out, man. Yeah. Love to see that. And there's the forward air, man. Nico taking the first stock. This might be uh, his first lead of the set so far. Mm -hmm. So far, he's been playing from behind a lot. Yeah, it's caught by the explosive flame. Really great placement from Abadongo there. Not wasting any time in to even out the stocks. Yep. Shield art is going to be used up here. Yep, it's used up. Oh, wow. I like that. Uses the force to cover the spot dodge yeah. after the parry, too, yeah, just in case uh, nothing was fast enough. That's one thing I've noticed that um, Abadango has been really good at is covering the defensive options that Nico's been presenting, for sure. Oh, that back oh, there! Oh, should have hit, but it didn't for some reason. Yeah, just it's barely crazy. off the mark. Yeah. But he did get that down tilt to forward air on the second attempt, so mm -hmm. you know, not too bad, just keeping Nico stuck at the ledge. Oh, dude, he went for it! Oh man, Abadango went for it too. Not able to find it either way. Oh man, they're really Dude. looking for it here. Yeah. Down throw. <laughs> they are seriously like disrespecting the hell out of each other right now. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. But back air is trade and Abadango is going to come out on top. Going to be able to get that next stock in. Okay, smash art right here. If Nico finds the right opening, oh, but unsafe air slash. Gonna get punished. Two neutral airs, a forward air. That's thirty-four percent. That smash art might have been the uh, saving grace for Nico, mm -hmm. who actually swipes uh, his left hand as uh, he throw it commits to that throw in game. And if there's any moment to like wipe your hand, it's probably like during your throws for sure. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Finds that corner di. Abadal is gonna be just fine. Man, Nico, even with Smash Art available, he's having a hard time oh, finding the kill. Oh, oh, great trade there. Wow, just, he couldn't close out the stock. And uh, yeah, here's uh, take two of Nico looking very disappointed. I can't even see his eyes because he's hiding in behind the, the game cam. And then his hair right right in front of his eyes. Only one. You can yeah. only see one. Yeah, he's so anime, right? <laughs> yeah, and look at his shirt too. Yeah, more a more anime than uh, the, that <laughs> little than the Japanese, little Japanese sure. player sitting right next to him. <laughs> Dang, uh, they're both pretty anime, man. Like Abba with his uh, blonde hair. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Alrighty, All right, here we go. Game number four here. Losers semis. Abadango up two to one. Nico, I mean, so far doing a really good job of keeping it close. Just 
it's been really hard for him to find those KOs. Right. Yeah, he's uh, trying to play a little bit more patient using those dashbacks, but I feel like Abadongo's recognizing that, and he says, okay, you're dashing back to try and space something out. I'll just keep pushing forward and push you to the ledge, and he already got 67% off of that. Yeah, and like, Abadongo doesn't really have to care about those dashbacks, too, because he can dash back himself and use um, auto reticle and explosive flame, which are really great projectiles to just, you know, apply pressure from a distance. Right. Here's all about the ledge. Definitely just waits it out consistently, knowing Nico is going to be consistently throwing out those hitboxes, waiting for the right moment to get up. Yeah. Still on the chase. Gets caught on Rising Aerial. Not quite able to oh, find anything. Oh, no. no. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's not good at all. Unfortunate air dodge there for him. 72% on Abadongo. Uh, just two more stocks before he can net himself this victory. Can't count out Nico out yet, though. Mm -hmm. Smash art right here. <sighs> yeah, I'm not able to find anything. Thought he had the read, but yeah. uh, Abadongo rolling right past it. Yeah, teleport cancel. Abadongo showing that, you know, he's like pretty consistent at that. I don't think he's missed one so far. How is he going to make it back to the stage, though? Oh, the drift! Yo. The air slash actually catches him. Yeah, definitely the uh, air slash hits deceptively below the ledge. Wasn't able to find the KO with it, but a forward air in Smash Minato Art will. And d only 6% on Nico that whole stock. So mm -hmm. This is what I'm talking about. You can't cut him out. There we go. All right, but this is the cutscene. Oh, okay. Wait for a read right here. Okay. Trying to mix him up. Mm -hmm. Low hit stun, but he still got 36% out of that. Abadongo is really good at switching up. It's like, okay, you're going to go shield art. I'm going to be able to convert off a different combo instead. Yeah, exactly. He doesn't just autopilot into his combo. He's actively thinking about that Monado art. And I think it's uh, throwing off uh, Nico for sure. Yeah, whereas mo most other players will like get caught off guard by that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Abadongo is showing man, he is a veteran, man. He played Smash 4. He's a top player. And he's not going to get fooled by, by these little tricks. Right. Okay. Is grab? Putting Nico back off stage. Oh, jump gone. But he does have jump art. The counter is so good. That should be the KO. Oh, okay. Back throw. That should be it, though. Yep. Yes, it will. Yeah, 36% on Abadongo. Yeah, looking really off, strong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Right, this is looking rough, but Nico gets a grab right here. Commits to a, a few too many pummels. Abadongo able to b burst out of that. Yeah. Okay, auto reticle. He's just going to catch auto targets in the air, so not going to be able to find anything. There we go. Air Slash comes in. Going to get some extra damage. Smash art once again here by the ledge. Oh, and he catches the upper. Really good for Nico right here. Back into the game with only 36% on himself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think that was supposed to be a bear, and then he accidentally inputted a fair instead. Ooh. Here we go. Parry in the grab. Got a back air. Got a neutral, another neutral air. This is looking rough for Nico right now. He's got jump art available though. Let's see if he can try and get something going. He does not. And another back air. Oh, very nice read on the directional air dodge. Just catches that with the long lasting hitbox a second time. Tries to get the grab to close it out, but not quite. All right, Nico, 142% right here. He's going to have to make such a strong comeback. He's in shield art, knowing he's going to die soon, but it already has gone. Oh, so careful right here. Down tilt. Buster art. Yeah, Alba just not going to deal with it. Again, he can just fade back and use auto reco. Oh, my God. That nearly killed. Ne next neutral air does it. Yep. Dude, yeah. he was behind him and it sent flying him forward. Oof. That was crazy. And that was your loser semis. Alba Dunkel will move on to loser's finals. I'm going to go use the restroom real quick. I'll be back before this next set starts. So don't go anywhere. All righty. You hate to see that, you hate to see the frustration, but you know what, Abadongo was just able to pull out on top there on the game four, so. Here we are, moving on to losers finals, and we're gonna see Sue and Abadongo, you know, face off, you know, we got a top three J uh, Team Japan here. So yeah, uh, Raito kinda getting the short end of the stick, unfortunately, but you know, Nico's gotta be happy with him himself, he's still got uh, some good wins, I know he wanted a little bit more than that, but you know, this is still the pre-show, this is still where you go to learn things, you, where you go to make sure you got yourself competitively ready for the next day.
But anyways, uh, my name's Sedge. Uh, Edmund is off doing Edmund things while he comes back. But I hope you guys are enjoying the Mango kickoff so far. We're going to be closing up with these next two couple of sets. Abadango and Sue will be our first one here. Our losers finals right now. Let's see what these two go for. Lucario, Palutena. Okay. I feel like Inkling sometimes has a bit of...